Yo, what's going on YouTube? Thank you guys so much once again for tuning into my channel. And in this video today, I'm going to be customizing a pair of Steph Curry MVP lows. Now you're probably sitting there at home thinking to yourself like, yo, that is a white and gold shoe. It looks fine. There's probably nothing that you can do to it in order to make it look better. Wrong. Now there's one thing on here that the customer actually brought to my attention. He thinks that there's one thing that could be changed on this particular pair of shoes right here to make it look a lot better. And I gotta say, I definitely agree with him. Now I'm gonna let you know straight away before we actually jump into this custom that this is going to be a very minor change, but you just gotta understand that even though it's going to be a small change, it's still going to be an extremely effective one. So what we are going to do is take a little bit of acetone. I'm gonna pour it into the actual cap of the bottle. There we go. I'm going to take a Q-tip, dip it into the acetone just for much easier access, and we are going to start getting the factory finish off of this back logo. And what we want to do now that we have gotten the factory finish off of the back logo is get a nice mixture of gold. This is just Angelus regular gold and Angelus regular silver. It is a 50-50 mix. The regular gold just has no shimmer in it whatsoever, but when you add a little bit of silver to the mix, it makes it pop a lot more. So I'm going to take this gold, we are going to open the cap, and then I'm going to be taking an angular brush right here from AngelusDirect.com. I will leave a link in the description down below if you want to purchase a brush set from them. We are going to dip it into our gold and we are going to get to painting. So I have finished painting the Steph Curry logo on the back gold. I don't know if you guys remember, but I did say that this was going to be an extremely basic custom, very simple stuff. But like I also said, it is extremely effective. I truly believe that it actually pulls the entire shoe together now. All those gold hits, it just made no sense for them to leave that logo on the back completely white. So what's left to do now is apply a little bit of finisher. I'm going to be using a regular Angelus matte finish. There's going to be no duller in here because pretty much all of the gold logo on here have a little bit of shine so I'm going to want to produce a little bit of shine on this back logo as well if you want to purchase this stuff right here any of the stuff that you saw in this video all links to purchase will be in the description down below and let's get going Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother. No! 